Hey, Jenny. Hi. What are you going to do today? Oh, I'm going to go to the amusement park. Really? How are you going to get there? Oh, I'm going to take the bus. Oh, hey, can I come too? Sure. Let's go. What you just heard was an example of the English grammar going to. We use going to when we want to talk about something we're going to do in the future. It's a future plan. A future plan or an arrangement. Sometimes we can also use the present simple to talk about things with future meaning. Let's look, look at some examples of going to for future plans. What are you going to do Saturday? I'm going to go to the amusement park. So in this example, we use the to be verb, to be verb in the form of I am, I'm, and then we use the verb in the gerund And then we use the two. <coughs> As a preposition. I'm going to. That's how you make the phrase about a plan or arrangement you're doing in the future. So it's the to be verb, the verb in the gerund, and then the two. So we can try it with other people besides I. He's going to. She's going to. They're going to. For example. Okay, that was easy. Now, <clears throat> let's talk about Present simple, I do, when it has a future meaning. We can use the present simple when we want to talk about future meanings when it is about a timetable or programs. Such as public transport, cinemas, or anything else that has a timetable or a program. Let's look at some examples. We are going to the amusement park. Our bus leaves at 9 a.m. So here, a bus has a timetable and we use the 
present simple to talk about the future meaning of when the bus will leave. We can say our bus leaves at 9 a.m. tomorrow. That has a future meaning. Easy, right? Let's look at another example. What time does the amusement park open? Tomorrow. Tomorrow is the future, and we use the verb does in the present simple to talk about when the time is a timetable, it will open. We can also use the present simple to talk about people if their plans are fixed like a timetable. If you know someone who has a job and goes to their job every day at the same time, their life has a timetable. For example, <coughs> next week I, I go to work every day at 8 a.m. This is my timetable, so I use the present simple. What time do you finish work tomorrow? This is the future, and we're talking about a timetable, so we use the present simple. So I hope these examples has, have helped you to understand how we use the present simple to talk about future meaning related to timetables and programs. And I hope this video has helped you to understand using going to plus the verb to talk about future plans or arrangements. So the next time you want to go to the amusement park with your friends, you can say, we're going to go to the amusement park. <laughs> yeah. Please feel free to leave us any comments or feedback about these videos and what you liked about them and what you thought. Thanks a lot and good luck with your English.